morning everybody it's Brandon and I am teaching today we are teaching Laura and Laura is um, very excited slash nervous slash freaking out deeply on the inside today I apologize for the shaky video because I am not a videographer and the tripod is currently in use by the other camera right here all right, Laura, you need to sit up a little bit taller with your body. You got a little bit of a hunchback going on. You know what I find hard? I find it hard to sink my butt in and sit up tall. You know what I mean? Sit on your seat bones and sit tall. And sit tall? Yeah, it's hard. Because you're relaxing the bottom half and straightening the top half. Yeah, but you're tightening your core. Right? You gotta use your core muscles. We're gonna get gym gym memberships and we're all gonna go to the gym. Alright, I will do it. You can be our trainer. I don't train gym, I just need to get fit. Alright. I eat too many chocolate bars. Alright, let's do it. Alright, one more walk lap and then we gotta change direction. Her, her smile the whole time though. Gave it away, Sophie. When you get over to the blue blocks, Laura, I want you to shorten your reins a little bit. Keep your hands together. And then ask for the trot. Hey there, what's that sound? Something is calling from on the ground. Hey, I didn't notice. Hey, I didn't notice. Inside leg. Because she wants to get spin. Yep, keep going. Remember, you have to have momentum. Forwards, trot. Forwards, forwards. Yep, get that lower leg on. Shorten your reins. Yep. There, keep your hands soft, down. Keep your hands lower. Forward momentum, right? Lower leg, lower leg, lower leg, kicker. Come on. Oh my goodness. Forwards. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Kick, inside leg. If his legs are that clean, that's because he was biting me when I was in there. That's okay, Laura. You need to get that leg on. Keep your eyes up where you want to go. That's a, that's a good trot. Now keep it. Add the leg. Lower leg. Keep her forwards. Keep her forwards. Come on. Forwards. There. And then sit two. There. Now push her. Push her again. Keep her straight. Inside leg keeps her over. There we go. Try to cross the green diagonal, keeping the same pace. I don't know where it is. It's right there. There we go. She knew. Forwards. There. Right Gotta go to the other direction. There. Can I have a rest for a sec? Yep. It's all scattered because I'm trying to keep her straight and do it so it's harder. So it's fun. Okay, we're going on Stella at a nice steady pace. Keep that pace. Go, Stella, go. Go, Stella, go. Go, Stella, go. Go. There we go. Good. Go. Keep going. Whoa. Lower your hands. Yeah. 
Add that lower leg. Better, Laura. She has zombie arms. Sit too. Look at, look at you go. That's a normal trot. Sit two again. Sit two. Yeah, now push her forward. Push her forward. There. Keep, keep your elbows bent. Much better. You're getting there. And then at the red block, sit up and have a walk. Sit two. Go. 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 Keep those elbows bent. Elbows bent. When you go when you go over the pole, you don't have to do anything with your arms. Okay. Here, go go. Better. Sit two. There. No, you you were on the right lead. Oh. Sit two. Woo. Go. Sit two. Bump. Oh, lost it. You, you. Yeah. There we go. Keep that forwards. She likes to pick up speed going downhill. So in your mind, pretend that you're gonna you're gonna ask for a canter so that she opens her stride, but don't don't technically ask for one unless you want to. I don't want to. Alright, so think in your head that you're gonna canter so that you add a little bit more leg pressure. A little bit more. Sit two. There we go. Stop. Lower those hands. Add the leg. Come on. Remember, you're pretending you're gonna canter. There we go. Remember, your hands stay soft. Around and then over the blue, come up the green and change directions again. Start looking, outside leg to turn. Oh, goodness. Oh. Should we walk for a sec? All the way over the white poles first. All right, walk and give her a loose rein. Soften those reins. Inside leg, right? There we go. Shorten your reins a little bit. There. Keep your hands together. God. Sometimes bounce too much over those. Yeah, that's okay. Is it two though? Two. Yeah. That's okay. You just lost your inside leg. Yeah, and I lost my horse. Come on. Draw right back around to it. She did that herself. Inside, she knows you're not paying attention to her. There we go. Much better.
Beautiful, Laura. Inside. Inside leg. There we go. Okay, Stella, we're going over these poles. Yeah. Inside leg, inside leg, inside leg, inside leg. Good job. And then sit up and have a walk and we'll change direction. Lower hands. Lower your hands. Sit up. Back. There. When you're ready, you're going to pick up the trot again. Practice with that left leg on. There, much better trot. Do you feel more comfortable in this trot? Yeah, she must like this one better. Inside, don't get your hands riding with your hands. It's hard. <laughs> Inside leg. There we go. Bend your elbows. Keep your hands together. Much better, Laura. You must like this side better. Keep your reins. So last month, if she had a trip, I would have freaked out. Keep going all the way over to the blue blocks, and then you can sit up and walk. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Inside leg. Now remember, sit tall, breathe out, there, and then soften and big pat.